Stonehenge is known for the solstices, but what is a solstice? Well, to explain, I've got a little demonstration. So this is the sun and this is the earth, but I need to point out they're not to scale. Now, many people are familiar that the earth rotates on its axis and the earth also orbits the sun. But what people don't realise is the earth is actually tilted on its axis and it's this tilt that gives us the seasons. So in this position, the northern hemisphere is pointing towards the sun. So the northern hemisphere has longer days. When you get the longest day of the year, that is the solstice. Now, when you get the longest day of the year in the northern hemisphere, you're getting the shortest day of the year in the southern hemisphere. And so that's the winter solstice in the southern hemisphere and the summer solstice in the northern hemisphere. But let's travel on six months later. Now the northern hemisphere is uh, in, in winter, it's getting less sunshine, and the southern hemisphere is bathed in a lot more sunshine. It has longer days. So this is what Stonehenge was built to look at. <laughs>